How you going, crew? So I'm a bit excited. Uh, Prestige Tackle have sent me a parcel. Here it is here. So um, Vince uh, called me up and he said, uh, got some lures for you, mate. I'll send them through. So uh, that was that's fantastic. That's uh, mighty generous of Vince. And um, so I sort of sort of said, oh, what do you want me to do with them, mate? And um, he's gone, oh, we'll give them a test and see how they go. So that's pretty cool. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. So I'll do the unboxing now. Open it up. I've got uh, so I've got this little one right here. It's a little stick bait by the looks of it. Little slow sinking, I'd say. Slow sinking stick bait. Oh, there's hooks in there. <laughs> oh yeah, got this little uh, little shallow diver. The uh, trout and the perch will go mental for that thing. Look at it. As long as the action's good, should be pretty cool. And uh, oh yeah, live bait minnow in rainbow trout. Look at that, folks. Yeah. All right, we'll we'll um we'll take them out of their boxes and we'll give them a bit of a go, eh? What I normally do is um, tie a bit of line to them and fill the bath up and troll them in the bath. So we'll give that a bit of a shot. So there's the um, live bait minnow in the rainbow trout pattern. What does it say about it? Um, seven grams, uh, slow sinking, 70 mil in size. Um, the live bait minnow is designed with special internal weights for unmatched casting capability. Uh, the live bait minnow makes a subtle fish calling wobble. A small twitch of your rod tip generates walk the dog action underwater. Live bait minnow will quickly become your go to bait. You know what I reckon that'll be good for? I reckon when they release the trout into the impoundments, I reckon if you trawl that behind your kayak, and you um, hug the bank up so that this dives about a metre off the bottom. I reckon the redfin perch are gonna absolutely hammer that. That'll be a perch lolly, I reckon. I, I'm hanging out to give that a go. So we've got this as well. I don't know if you can see that. Bit of a rattle. What does it say about it? It's all in Japanese. Oh yeah, on the back. Oh, we've got some English here. Right oh. So um, the size is 40, 40 millimeters and it comes in a 70 millimeter version as well. The weight is four grams. Uh, and 8 grams, so obviously the 70 millimeters, the 8 grams one, and it's slow sinking. And uh, does it have anything else to say about it? Nope, don't think so. So I reckon, I reckon this would do really well uh, for brim. I reckon if you cast that, let it sink, and then just twitch the rod back, wind in slow and twitch the rod back so that it darts along and sinks a bit and darts along. That'll be a real good brim lure, I reckon. And um, I reckon if you cast that into a river, that'll be good for um, trout and perch in rivers as well, I reckon. That'll be really, really, really good. So see how it's translucent, like that. The translucent ones um, I tend to use in the middle of the day. Um, in the mornings and in the evenings, as you start getting the low light, I stick more to a solid color. 
So I would use that personally in the middle of the day. If anyone else has got any other suggestions, feel free to let me know. And uh, last but not least, Micro Min. Okay, so it's that one there. It's got a rattle as well. I love these um, shallow diving stumpy lures. They just have such a, a good little little wobble to them. They just sort of they just sort of wobble like that in the water. And for whatever reason, the fish love it. Maybe it looks like a wounded bait fish or something. So it says here, bass, trout, perch, grunter, redfin, brim, flathead. Yep, yeah, I can see, I can definitely see trout, perch, or the redfin, uh, and brim and flathead taking this. As for the bass and the grunter, no idea, never caught them. So, yeah. Uh, Micro Min is one of the smallest lures able to transmit a strong action through to your rod tip. Its frantic action grabs the attention of predators that have no hesitation in slamming it. Small and shaky it looks, but tiny and tough it is. There you go. There's a bit of marketing for you folks. Very cool. So folks, uh, Prestige Tackle, uh, you find them in Bustleton, and um, I know that they stock Caltex in Collie, and they stock the Caltex in Harvey, um, and I've grabbed heaps of gear from there, and, and a lot of the gear will catch the freshwater species, no problem, no problem at all. Another local supplier, um, and as you probably already know, I like to support local, and it seems that local are supporting me, which is pretty cool, I'm pretty excited about that. So uh, Vince from Prestige Tackle. Thank you very much, mate. I am hanging out to give those a go. In fact, um, this weekend, I'm probably gonna go perch fishing out of Harvey and also Wellington Dam. So, we'll see how we go. So Josh, you keen to give these lures a go? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Where are we gonna use them? Um, maybe Harvey Weir or the river. Yeah. Yeah, sounds good. Okay, mate. No worries. Uh, if you like this video and you want to see more, uh, hit the subscribe button down here if you're on YouTube, otherwise it doesn't show. Or if you uh, hit the link up there, you can watch another video. Blocked you out there. <laughs>